Good morning, everybody, and welcome to uh, my video, Painting Nature and Greater Nature, Expressing the Appreciation of Nature Through Art and Painting. So uh, here is a forest scene. I'm starting here. You can find, uh, by the way, you can find a lot of my, my artwork on Art of Kuzma, one word, and uh, also Steve Kuzma Fine Art at the Noise Museum, Stockton Noise Museum in Atlantic City and studio in Summers Point. Um, this particular painting is painted uh, from the forest and one can see all the gradual layers of the pines and the, uh, the trees, soft firs, the balsam fir, uh, I really jo enjoy being in nature, walking amongst the trees, taking hikes, jumping into waterfalls, pools. Um, something that really inspires me and um, I do whenever I can. So this started as a drawing. One can see the white of the paper here. And then I use almost like a Sumi painting um, watercolor. Then I build it up and uh, with uh, different layers of, of, of paint, water mixable oils, and then it slowly builds up uh, to where I'll use pastels. So you can see the movement uh, that's created by this. It's not a, a static um, painting and uh, or drawing. I use a painting and a drawing at the same time, it's like a drawing with color. So here you have a, uh, a scene where at this point I'm adding some pastel just to enhance some of the pastel that's underneath it. And, and to me, it's I'm pretty happy with it just the way it is. So starting with that one, and as we move on in nature, um, there are uh, mountains as well. So this is a series of, of mountain scenes. And at this point, I, I've, uh, uh, these are inspired by the lake and the mountain together and uh, how the, the water uh, and the light moves um, throughout the day. I just enjoy painting um, mountain scenes. Uh, they're, they're nostalgic to me and um, bring out a lot of... Um, a lot of inspiration. So here's another scene uh, that I painted many layers. So it, it starts with a, an oil and it goes to watercolor. It starts with a watercolor, sorry, then it goes to oil. And then here I'm just adding a little, a little pastel highlight. So at this point, this has quite a lot of layering on it and um, this just little enhancement. Uh, goes a long way in uh, bringing it to uh, completion. It's ready to show. Uh, so again, this is probably from the same group here. And um, that little light that will move at the edge of a horizon. Um, uh, often seen while we're driving. Uh, it's, it's, it's quite... Uh, Again, uh, and inspiring for me. Um, and we're on the seam of um, more of a contemporary feel for a forest. Um, you're just surprised by how the light moves and finds, especially in the early morning hours and late in the day, um, how the light moves in the forest. So uh, I, I, I make many of these drawings, actually. And uh, 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 it, it does surprise me actually to paint and then what I see and discover every day in nature is, is also its own um, its own inspiration and reward it leaves me uh, inspired anytime I'm I'm uh, in nature walking or hiking so uh, just continue on to this theme I'm gonna put some some of the pastel powder I had on the other one. Put it onto this one here. It's 
is another scene that um, I already have a white base under this. So when I um, draw into uh, the white base, which is actually still setting in, um, that will blend very nicely into the the paint underneath and then the pastel over it. So, sorry, the camera moving a little bit. And so going from um, the forest scenes, uh, oftentimes I would consider framing them and often paint into the mat itself. So here's one where I painted into the mat and then um, and you can see I've also painted the frame as well. So this is another way that I, I like to work. Um, 